guys, it is your boy, Dukester Reels here, Paul Duke here, back on your screens on another video. This video is going to be a little bit of a sadder one. Um, yesterday, now this is going to be shocking. Yesterday, I was just getting on my phone and then I saw on Twitter, uh, one of my favorite actors of all time, Bob Saget, passed away. And now this is really shocking because... I noticed that he, he he was still very active, and I was like, really? No, they didn't find a cause of death, so right now I'm just assuming it could have been natural causes, but I thought I would make this video and, and you know, talk to you guys about some stuff. So, I got introduced to Bob Saget when I was really little. I never met him, no, but I really loved the show Full House. I like Fuller House too, but I prefer Full House. I own the first two seasons of Full House. I wish I owned the whole thing. At least at least there's Amazon, am I right? <laughs> Anyways, this is not a funny video. This is actually a very sad, heartbreaking video. So I saw a notification on my phone that said, Bob Saget di uh, dead at 50, uh, 65. I was like, what? No, this can't be real. So I look on there and it's a whole bunch of tweets saying, rest in peace, Bob Saget, and I was like, no, so I did tweet, actually got a lot of attraction, it didn't get any likes, sadly, but I did tweet, rest in peace, Bob Saget, this is really sad, because I really enjoyed his, uh, I never really seen any of his comedy stuff, but I did see Full House, and I did see Fuller House, and, you know, I, that's why I really liked him, I also liked the other actors, you know, John Stamos, and Dave Collier, and then you got the rest of them, I didn't see anything from them yet, but um, a lot of people were tweeting, rest in peace. He was found dead in his hotel room. There was no, they said there was no drugs or anything related to that. So I'm honestly assuming it could be natural causes. I honestly don't think it's anything else unless they do find something. But it's going to be, re this is really sad. It's, it's really heartbreaking because he was still really young. He, he was still really young. 65 is not that old of an age at all. And to find out he's gone is really, really shocking and upsetting. And it's like, how in the world? Because it doesn't seem possible. And it's just this just goes to show a lot of our favorite actors. If you're a 90s, 2000s, I'm an early 2000s kid, you'll know Bob Saget, I'm pretty sure. Even today when I went to school, a lot of people were talking about it. A few people were talking about it. I was like, dang. See, that just goes to show the influence that he had on you. Um, especially if you're a 90s, 2000s kid. Or if you were, you know, um, growing up or you were even alive in the 90s, you'll know him. Man, I don't. I, I, didn't, I wanted to make this video last night. It was kind of hard. And so I was like, oh, I won't make it tonight. But maybe, uh, and then I do today and... You know, it's it's really sad. It's, it's something you don't expect to happen until it happens. And, uh, got a piece of hair in my mouth. I just shaved tonight, so, so I look like this. Um, yeah. There was a lot of other stuff that I know he did and stuff. And I even followed him on, like, uh, Twitter and TikTok. I'm not sure if I followed him on Instagram. I might have. If he has an Instagram, I probably did. But, you know, it's, you know, this is a really hard video to make. When I made the John Huber video, it was really hard to make. The Road Warrior Animal video, it was a little bit easier because, um, um, I wasn't, I was fond of the Road Warriors and, you know, but it, it's, it's really hard making these videos. I'm making this one because I was such a big fan of him. I really liked his role as Danny Tanner and, uh, it just goes to show the influence somebody has on you. You know, I want to be a wrestler and a singer. I wouldn't even mind doing acting. That would be pretty cool. Like, if I become a professional wrestler and I don't like, like, I'm, I was talking to my dad and I was talking to everybody about it. Like, maybe when I'm older, I might do truck driving because that's what my dad does. And maybe I'll do acting. If, if I, you know, if I'm big enough in the public eye, which that's not the real goal I'm going for. I'm just going to, you know, I just, I love entertaining people. That's what I love to do. And that's what I want to continue doing. And so acting is one of the things you entertain people in. Do it, man. Um, a lot of people I know do it for publicity. I won't be doing it for publicity. I would just be doing it because, hey, I love entertaining people. 
Um, a lot of people are like, Paul, you could become a comedian. Who knows? And, yeah, but yeah, I uh, grew up watching him. And now that he's gone, it's going to be really hard. A lot of people that you know are passing away now. It's like, wow. Who knows, next it could be another famous actor. And it's going to be like, like, like. Like, I'll probably do video, a lot of videos like this if a lot of my favorite actors pass away. It's going to be sad, though. These videos are always so hard to make and stuff. It's like, you honestly, you don't want to. I decided to make this because I, he was one of my favorite actors. Um, there's a lot of people know me for Dukes of Hazard. Being a big fan of that. I was a big fan of Full House. I still am. Fuller House was pretty entertaining. I'm not going to lie about that. I... I binged watched Fuller House and it was really it was really good. And uh yeah. Man, this is really hard. I don't really know. And, and yeah, he was he was famous actor, famous comedian, you know. You know, I didn't even know he was a comedian until I started seeing videos. I was like, "Oh, I didn't even know he was a comedian." And I like comedians. I like Jeff Dunham. Uh I get that from my dad as well. Jeff Dunham's a really good comedian. I've heard others. I think I heard a, George Lopez once I didn't even know he was a comedian until I heard him I was, I was like I was I was with my dad and I was like hey dad is that George Lopez and I think he said yeah that's George Lopez and then there's a couple other guys um shoot what's his name um oh uh, I, I don't oh Jeff Foxworthy I really like him but um yeah anyways guys that's really gonna do it for this video I thought I'd make a video and now 10 seconds of quiet I like to do this. 10 seconds. <sighs> okay, guys. It's going to do it. Rest in peace, Bob Saget. You will be remembered by millions of people. And I will see you guys in a future video. Peace.